Today we're going to be working with a 770 bore gauge in your Data Shore 4.0 program. We will be pairing the bore gauge to your system. The bore gauge has two menus. The first one you will click mode very quickly once and then you will see set and then you can move in through the options going back to the, the main uh, display. The second you hold mode and it will show unit and then you can click to see the options. Now we're going to turn the Bluetooth on so it is on the first menu so you will click very quickly mode and then keep pressing it until you see BT which is the Bluetooth option and then you click set twice for on and then mode again to go back to the main menu and you can see on the screen that the Bluetooth icon is showing. Now that you have your Bluetooth on, we will uh, pair the tool to your data show program and to do that we need to go into the second menu which is clicking and holding the mode button until you see unit, let go, and then click it three times to get into the Bluetooth configuration menu. Click set once to accept, and then look for the pair option and click mode to pair. You will see the little dots in the calibration, that means it's selected, and then if you click set again, it's gonna go back to the main menu, and you can start your measurements. Now that the Bluetooth is on, you will see a flashing icon right there. It is flashing because it's looking for a connection. So let's go ahead and open your data show program on your computer. Uh, make sure you have a network active green light uh, to, to be sure it's working correctly. Go to the gateway tab. Look for your gateway under the gateway label. Once you select it, just give it a second. It will um, connect and secure. Uh, the blue light will turn on. Once it's there, look for the MAC uh, address of your tool. Uh, this one doesn't have one because we use it for testing purposes, but uh, when you purchase yours, you will come with a sticker with the MAC address on it. Uh, match that MAC address to the MAC address there. Click or where it says blocked to allow. Once it's green, wait a little bit and you will see it queue and you will see it online uh, once it connects. It does take a little bit of time. Um, as you can see there, it's online and it's green. Um, you can go to the home um, tab and look for that MAC address again, you will see that the measure button would be green. If you click that, you will get your measurements. In the case you have to reset your Bluetooth connection to Datashore, um, you can use the first menu, uh, click the mode four times to go to the Bluetooth menu, and then set to select, click set three times to get to the reset option and then click mode to accept and go back to the main menu as you can see and um, just keep it in mind that the reset option will not show on the menu unless the tool has been connected or paired prior to resetting.